we're taking these two things on the left hand side of the reaction, our carbon dioxide and our water, and everything on the left hand side of the reaction we call the reactants. And so these are going to react and in, in the presence of light and they're going to form sugar or glucose and oxygen. And these are our products. So everything on the right hand side of this equation are what we call products. So think about it this way. This is one way to help you remember it, especially if you're a visual person, right? So basically think about photosynthesis. Think of the word sun whenever you think of photosynthesis, or I should say light rather, because think about photo. It sounds like you're taking a picture, right? And to take a picture, you need light. You either have to be in a room or outside where there's light, or if you're in a dark place, you use your flash. So that word photosynthesis, think of this image of the sun, right? Now, if your car is out on ice, so if you're driving and you hit a patch of ice, you don't want to go over that ice, right? So, so look at carbon dioxide here. So the first three letters of carbon dioxide, they make up the word car, all right? And now think about water, right? So that ice, it's just frozen water. All right, so if the sun melts that ice, then you can drive because you don't want to be driving on that ice. But just imagine that this is like a road somewhere and there's ice on it. You don't want to drive on that ice, so the sun has to melt that ice. Then the car can go. Now, so all you have to do, photosynthesis, picture that sun, then picture the car, and picture that car on the ice here. And that's going to help you remember that What's happening is that carbon dioxide is reacting with water in the presence of light and G and O spell the word go, right? Glucose and oxygen. So remember the word go. So remember you need when the car is going to drive over ice, you need that sunlight for the car to go. All right, hopefully this makes sense. And, you know, so to think about photosynthesis, to think about these reactants, you, one way to do it, just remember that word photosynthesis, picture that light and then picture the car on the ice and remember that it's carbon dioxide and water reacting in the presence of light and that makes the car go, go, G-O, glucose and oxygen. So if this just confused you even more, then don't worry about it, but for some people out there that are visual and like to think in pictures, this can hopefully be a way to remember what's happening in photosynthesis. And I know it's silly and I know it's goofy, but sometimes these goofy little ways to remember things help make it stick the most.